the whole time he was working with Makoto's sister, he was really just some homicidal maniac. Come on, we gotta take that bastard to catch you down. Isn't that recording we got enough proof to do it? No. Akechi is merely a tool. His orders come from elsewhere. The grand mastermind behind this all. An unimaginable fiend capable of arranging the murder of a suspect inside of a police station. Unless we find out who that is, we will continue being targeted even if we defeat Akechi. But what means do we have of learning his identity? We'll have to make Akechi say it. Though once we do, that mastermind will likely eliminate us. I think that will be the case eventually, regardless of whether or not we learn his identity. The only reason it hasn't happened yet is because we're an easy target to blame for his crimes. If he realizes that's no longer possible and abandons that plan, he may opt to kill us immediately. Damn it! So we don't got a choice but to go with that bastard's suggestion. But if we go into the palace like we're told, he'll get arrested and then Akechi will kill him! Palace. The palace. Actually, there's something I'd like to say regarding... Aha! We can use the palace to our advantage! What's this all of a sudden? There's a way. A way to get past Akechi and get the Mastermind to lay off of us, all while learning his identity. Really? You gotta be kidding me! If he wants to kill the guy, why not let him? That is, inside of a palace. Yes, we could have him kill the cognitive version, all the while believing he killed the real one. Yeah, that's it! It seems that's our only option. Listen close, everyone. I have a plan for how we can carry this operation out. Ever since the death of their teenage leader, the Phantom Thieves have fallen silent. However, the police intend on continuing this investigation until the case is fully solved. I'm sorry I'm late. I had to finish a few things at work. Where are they? Waiting upstairs. Go tell them to come on down. I'm gonna fetch him. You're... her sister, correct? Makoto told me everything. Futaba-chan, I'm sorry that I caused you so much trouble this past summer. Eh, it's ancient history now. Man, that goddamn detective! Look who's here. <laughs> hey, you big bastard! 